Well, for its 45th year, the Brooklyn Academy of Music's iconic festival, Dance Africa, is back, and it's happening in person. Well, News Fell's Jordan Kassane was smack dab in the middle of the festival where people from all around the world gathered to celebrate African, Caribbean, and African American culture. Family, fashion, and fun. Dance Africa Bazaar 2022 has officially arrived. BAM is back. The annual festival surrounding the BAM headquarters and stretching across blocks and blocks of Fort Greene welcomes over 150 vendors offering African performances, cuisine, jewelry, and beyond. When it started 45 years ago, really celebrated African American companies that were learning African dance and culture. And so this year, 45th year, it's all African-American companies again. Dancers take the stage through the doors of the Peter J. Sharp building. These performances are ticketed only, but the outdoor bazaar definitely does not disappoint. Getting emotional, it's okay. beauty and dancing and community and that's what's so special about it. President of the Ashanti Fields Collections tells us her family owned business has been participating in Dance Africa for the last 30 years. We started out in the parking lot before these buildings came up and then when um, the buildings came up they moved us over here and I, this is our signature spot we're here every year. Field sources authentic fabrics all the way from Ghana for her pieces. Many of them, she says, imprinted with African Adinkra symbols that represent concepts like unity, something she says the community was missing until coming together to celebrate in person again. We have uh, longed for this. It was uh, something missing not being able to be here. And now that we're all joined together, I think the community um, is just really special, just really special. Dance Africa does wrap up tomorrow night, so be sure to head to our website at news12.com to find out how you can get tickets to the final performance. In Fort Greene, Jordan Kassane, News 12.